It was Christmas Eve, babe, in the drunk tank. An old man said to me, won't see another one. And then he said to me, the real mountain through. I turned my face away and dreamed about you. But the wind goes right through you, it's no place for the old When you first took my hand on a cold Christmas Eve You promised me Broadway was waiting for me You were handsome, you were pretty, queen of New York City When the band finished playing, they howled out for more Sinatra was swinging, all the drunks they and we kissed in the corner, then danced through the night And the boys of the NYPD choir were singing Galloway Bay And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day And the boys of the And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Vlogmas number four. Not day four, number four. It's Friday today. It's a lovely grey day, as usual. <laughs> this is why I always say at the beginning of my vlogs now. It's very grey in the UK at the moment. Don't know about you, but that's what I'm finding. <laughs> so, I thought I'd bring you along on my day. I wanted to start on a song, because I feel like I haven't been doing enough Christmas songs in the Vlogmas. Now, I don't know if you saw my Vlogmas last year, but basically, before I even started any vlog, I'd sing, like, a line of a Christmas song. And I really enjoyed it, but it hasn't really panned out that way this year as well as the fact I'm doing it every other day. I'm gonna tell you now, next year we're gonna do every other, every day again because I have a bit of FOMO with myself. <laughs> I don't know why, but I have this fear that I'm missing out compared to last year. I don't know. So, next year I think we're gonna, I think we will do every day and I might pre, I might start filming Vlogmas slightly early so that it's easier to manage and I'm not gonna plan any trips for December so I can do it. But anyway, that's, that's another year, that's another, another time. However, it's Friday today. I thought you'd, I'd bring you along on my day. Me and Niall are actually about to go out and we're gonna go on a big Christmas shopping trip. Now when I say Christmas shopping, I don't mean like Christmassy decorations or anything like we've done before, but actually buying Christmas presents for people. There's a few things I need to pick up as well because we are going away in about three days now. No, no, it's Friday. It's Friday, no, it's th wait, I'm saying it's Friday, it's Thursday, it's not Friday. In three days, we're going away on a trip, and so I want to grab a few bits as well. So, it's gonna be a fun day. Blue's been listening to me sing, Fairy Tale of New York. I hope you liked that snippet. I feel like that's a very, very difficult song to sing, but I thought it was just a nice, nice little vibe. I used to actually sing that when I used to gig around the Christmas period, so I have got like my version in my key written out in my little songbook, but yeah, it's not the original. I'm not quite as cockney and wonderful as the original, but I hope that you enjoyed that little bit anyway. Let me show you my outfit of the day. So today, I thought I'd go a little bit camo. <laughs> All right. So I've gone for my Urban Outfitters mum jeans. I did actually wear these in my last shopping video. I think, I think they're my shopping jeans, you know? And then I've got this new little misguided top on. It actually matches my trackies that I wear quite a lot. I wanted like a full set, so <laughs> we've got that. And then we've also got this new camo teddy jacket, which will be in a haul, which will be the video after the next. Yes, this will be in the haul, as well as other things that are quite festive. I think New Year's Eve dresses, Christmas party dresses, and obviously a teddy or three and this is one of them. I do want to open up the advent calendars with you because I feel like I feel like it's really hard to keep up with you and them when I'm vlogging every other day. Now in between, well I'm not really vlogging every other day, I am doing 
two days in one sometimes and like yesterday I filmed a different video to go up while I'm away and I will be videoing when while I'm away by the way some people have asked me that I just feel it's a bit strange so I hope you're enjoying vlogmas so far and we have lots more Christmassy plans to go I think today's gonna be nice and festive as well I really enjoy bringing you shopping <laughs> I don't know why it's just a new one of my new faves and then I'll give you like my haul at the end of if I manage to get anything I'm gonna have to tell my family and anyone I buy a present for today not to watch this video though because if I do show you they're gonna know their present which is not gonna be great <laughs> but yes anyway Let's do the advent calendars. Also, we've got a little pop of <laughs> Why are you sleeping in the corner, you weirdo? She's a little bit scatty today. Her little foot's getting a bit better, though. How's your foot going, love? Let's have a look. Give us a limp. <laughs> no, I'm joking. She is actually getting better, though. I think she just needs to rest, eat some soup, and feel like a wonderful cat in the corner of the room. <laughs> She's sulking because she doesn't like my singing. Right. I'm on my way into the living room. I got I got the calendars at the ready. I've got blues, I've got Niles, and I've got two for me. And we're gonna open by the tree. I think that's better. You can't be sleeping me at all. This is so hard. Just gonna open the calendars before we go, is that okay? Yeah. Gotta open yours. You've got two windows to open, love. Oh! Pretty well knows. Oh, you want your advent calendar! Oh, she's so excited. Wait, have you eaten your breakfast today? We had a new rule. She stopped eating her breakfast because she waits for the advent calendar now. So, let me open up one of mine first while we wait for Niall. So what day is it? Is it the 5th? 6th? 7th? I don't know, what day is it? I was saying the whole time. Six. Happy Friday, and then I was like, oh wait, it's not Friday. It's the 6th. It's the 6th, okay, so I've done four. I've got two to do. Wait, four. So in number four in the Locks Tan, we have people are so excited. You need to get a frame though. You won't get a frame. We need to see what you get. Is a Verbena body lotion. Lovely. And then we have oh this looks nice. This is a Fleur's de Circia Cherry Blossom Balm, I think. Looks lovely. It probably smells lovely too. What have you got? I've got a grenade bar. Oh, I like grenade bars. I'm not allowed that. So this is my they protein cook. athlete. I've got a high protein rocky road. Something else I'm not allowed. <laughs> You're gonna get in trouble. Trying to get me fired. Then in number six, I have a shampoo. So in my body shop, this looks really nice actually. It's a softening body butter. Bottom. <laughs> softening body butter in berry bonbon. I think it's one of their Christmas editions. Ooh, that smells glorious. What is it? Nice. It's nice, isn't it? We just need to find a mango item now. If, like, if there's a mango item in one of them today, can you um, do your little show? Number five, we have an Ethiopian green coffee firming body cream. I'm going to be very creamy after these have candles. Right, we're in the car and we're off. We've got the Christmas playlist at the ready. It's actually not Michael Bublé today. Yes. We've got, we've got a golden oldie Christmas song. <laughs> Abuse. So, because it's not Michael Bublé, will you give us a dance? <laughs> No, not dance. Know. I don't have a sing song. Okay. Carpool karaoke with Niles. I don't know the words to any of these songs. Yet. I'm, I will, but if you laugh, and I won't do it again. Okay. You're laughing. Stop it. <laughs> I'm, get, I'm getting. I know it's a bit. You know, I'm warming up. Okay, keep going. Warm up that voice. Sounds like a sad rat. Just thinking, Michael Bublé for short his boobs. <laughs> Get your boobs out. Boobs is out and about right now. Boobs. Boobs is in the car. One thing I
also baby girl. It's my birthday in. Baby girl? How never How many we're days? In the of the road. We've just arrived at Westfield. It's my birthday in, in car park. It's my birthday in eight days, and then it's Christmas. So what? Yeah, and are you where am get I me? taking you? That's not for my birthday. That's a that's a work trick that I'm I'm joining you on because I'm a good boyfriend. <laughs> okay, I'm not even gonna go there. <laughs> Anyway, we have just arrived at Westfield and we're walking through the car park. Wait, we need to remember where we are. So, we've just got here. I'm very excited. What shop do you want to go into, Niall? All Saints. I'm not an All Saints gal. It's a bit too dark for me. I like the bright Look how pretty it is. We just passed one of my new fave shops, Typo. Might have to go there on the way back. Hop into Typo. I like Typo. There's lots of cute things. Look how festive it looks. I mean, I've already showed you this before when I went shopping with Rebecca, but every day, every, not every day, every time I come, I'm more amazed. It's glorious. So, we're just heading in to Decidual. I think that's how you say it. It's actually my mum's favourite shop, so I'm going to have a peek if I can find anything nice for her. It's very bright, though. You think I like bright? Look at this. Actually, my mum might quite like that. I'm gonna definitely have to tell my mum not to watch this vlog. My mum might like this now, what do you think? I think she'd wear that. I actually think she might. <gasps> Maybe she, oh my god, look at that. Oh my god, she'd love that. Look at this little tiger on the arm. It's like a denim jacket with the, that's so nice, don't you think? Popping on the jacket. It's definitely not popping, she wishes. So I'm currently trying on for my mum. I actually quite like it. I feel like it kind of goes with my outfit. <laughs> I feel a little bit like a pimp. <laughs> I mean, I would wear it myself, but I can see that my mum would. Look at that arm. That's a good arm. Right, we're currently in Lula, and my next mission is a gilet for Brian. So I don't know if you saw Vlogmas one, but Brian's obsessed with gilets, so I want to get her a nice one. And I've seen a whole gilet shelf in Lula. I don't know if it's going to be the right place to get one, but we'll have a, we'll have a peek nice colour. I need to, oh no that's a coat. Oh, and we don't have as much option as I thought. So these are coats. And I was thinking this would be nice on Bri, this colour. <sighs> However, we only have these ones. Any of them shout Bri at you? She's like a gilet pro so. I know. She's it's... probably got a black one already. Yeah she's got a black one. I just wanted to see if there was one that was like a bit of spice. Hey, I was about to tell them about the gilet. Oh, you just licked off my makeup. So we aborted New Look because... Tacky. It's not tacky in New Look, it's just not... It wasn't a nice one. I, I'm only going to get one if like one shouts at me. I need to go home with Bri. So I'm currently in Topshop and I haven't spotted any gilets yet, but I've spotted my blue coat. So this coat is actually still in stock. If you did like my blue coat when I went shopping last time, it's still here, it's glorious, I absolutely love her. She makes me feel like a snowflake. I have actually got a, a very bright yellow one, however. Do you know what, I'm not actually that into these like shaggy fluffy ones. I feel like that's way more like faux fur fluffy. It's the teddy, isn't it? They're close, they're cousins, aren't they? <laughs> that's kind of true, actually. There's a cousin, the teddy coat is a cousin to the fluff. I don't feel like I need any more teddy coats now anyway, but I just wanted to update you just in case you did like my coat. They do seem to still have it, which is glorious because it's glorious. <laughs> Speaking of teddy coats though as well, I have just spotted this one in Topshop, which I don't need because I have one very similar, but it is absolutely lovely. It actually looks like kind of like a camel version of that pink one I got too. Love it, lovely, don't need it, but if you want a teddy, I feel like Topshop is very good for the teddy coats actually. What are you thinking of that now? It's nice, but you've got I'm about... saying that. I'm just saying if anybody wants a teddy coat, this is a good one. Right, I'm currently in Zara, and there's quite a few little bits that I like, I must say. I know I was doing my Christmas shopping, and I was, I was originally in here to get a gilet for Bri. Couldn't find one, found a few things I quite liked. <laughs> So we have this big cable knit jumper, which um, I've actually been looking for for a while. This is a khaki one, actually. I've already tried this one in the shop and it's glorious. I'll show you though. And then we have another kind of very different, but sequin jumper. How pretty is that for Christmas? It's kind of cropped as well, but with like a balloon sleeve. Let's see if I can show you. 
There we go, see it's balloon sleeve. And then we've got two pairs of jeans, because I quite fancied like, I haven't really got any skinny jeans anymore. And I wanted some that weren't like Joni jeans that are really high waisted. These are kind of high waisted though I think, but we'll see if they fit. And then we have this very sparkly top. And it's a cami, which I'm not usually for, so I'll have a try and see what they're like. So this is the sequin balloon sleeve. I feel like I quite like it, but I don't know, I'm not not as obsessed as I thought I was going to be. I thought it was going to be one of those sparkle moments, because the glitter's kind of like colourful in, in certain lights, you know that? That kind that's like, looks silver in some lights, like colourful in others. I quite like it, but I'm not sure about where the crop sits. Lots of other things. So this is the cable knit. I am obsessed. I think it's just so cute. It's like some jeans, some chunky trainers. And I was saying that it would probably look nicer with skinny jeans. So I want to have a try with some of the new ones. Although I do like it with the mum jeans. I think it's just a bit like shabby chic <laughs> in clothes. But I just think it's really nice. Like a boyfriend fit. This is actually a small, but it's just quite oversized. But love it absolutely love it i'm gonna look like a christmas tree <laughs> so here is one of the jeans and what i love is how they're kind of like in between high-waisted and not so they're not like i don't know they don't look massively ho overly high-waisted that if you had a bloat it'd be really obvious like a joni jean do you know what i mean i feel like that's what put me off joni jeans they're just a little bit too showy <laughs> but i actually really love these they're really stretchy got a nice little um it's just like normal jeans, that's what we want in our lives, isn't it? And it does actually look nice with the, the big jumper, I must say. Niall's quite right. And then these are kind of exactly the same as the other jeans, but like a slightly more pale blue. I think I kind of prefer them actually, to be honest, because if you look, let's have a look at the difference. So see these ones I just had on, they're quite, kind of more of a sky blue, and these are, I think, um, they're not grey, but they're verging onto like a slightly more faded look, which I think is a little bit better for this time of year. This is a bit more summer, this is a bit more now. I must say, this looks horrific on me. <laughs> this is so bad. Look at it, it's just a weird shape. It took me a very long time to get on as well, and I don't know why, but no, not today. <laughs> so, we have just left Zara. We've both got a bag. Actually, <laughs> that's what I was going to tell you. What? I was trying, you know when I tried on my sequin black top, and it got what? very stuck? I lit a top, I couldn't get a top off. So it was actually stuck. So I was there for like 10 minutes getting a hot sweat on. Don't buy that top, whatever you do. But I did want to say, those jeans, I will link. I'll link everything in the description box when I do a haul at the end, but those specific jeans, if you're into like Topshop Joni jeans, like everybody loves them. They're really stretchy and flattering. These ones are like that kind of flattering style, but I think they're just a little bit of a nicer, design because they just look like you know they've got the little holes for the belt and stuff like that but i'll link them i got a size uk8 which i always do so they're very true to size but i just wanted to let you know because jeans are a tough one to find a good one and i feel like those are good ones and they were called like super super high rise stretch there's lots of other colors as well but i'll link them anyway we are now heading into h&m and we're gonna have a little peek at the kids' clothes. We're gonna have a look for um, Niall's little sister's Christmas presents. So it's all gonna be very cute. It's gonna look like we're parents, and I don't mind that. <laughs> we're parents of two little girls called Eliza and Jemima. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? Can we get them that little red dress? Look at it. This is so cute. I can't wait to have kids so I can just buy cute things. You didn't know what? <laughs> I don't know what size they are. <laughs> you embarrassed them in you, that's why you changed it. Lyle no, doesn't know how old his sisters are. I think they're 11. This is so cute. I need to make sure I don't film any kids. <gasps> Look, little unicorns with rainbows. That's too small though. Yeah, that is too small. Like <gasps> Get them these little ears. Oh, look at these. That's cute. Imagine them in leopard print bottoms. What age is year seven? Year seven's 12. Hmm? 12 to 13, but they're small, aren't they? They're small for their age. Oh my gosh, I'm, I just, oh look, how cute is that? <laughs> Get them them, they'd fit them. That would fit them. Oh, that's seven to eight. <laughs> but they must have a little bit of an older one, seven to eight. That is so cute, I can't wait to have children. It's a baby Parker. I think we're in the, the wrong age section, but Niall, look. 
Imagine we had a little boy and you could twin. Oh, look, how cute are these? Why don't they make them in my size? But they'd, they'd fit these. They would fit them. No, there's way more cute things than that around. Yeah, but they've got to like it. It's not just... Yeah, they will. Oh, look how cute they are. They're jeggings for little girls. <laughs> right, we found the next best thing from the pink leather jackets. It's a furry coat. And it's the right size. Basically, Niall's little sisters usually kind of wear the same thing because they're like a similar age. So I think if they both had one of these... Niall said, trust me, Niall picked up a blue jumper with a rabbit on. There are so many more cute things about no, that I, trust me, I know a little, I know a girl's brain because I used to be a little girl. Oh, I like that. That's cute. We're on a quick Nando stop. I have a chicken butterfly, plain, because I don't like spice, and a creamy mash of corn on the cob, and my cheese is gonna go on top. Lovely. And then Niall's got a lot of different versions of chicken. <laughs> No, I've got the same as you, apart from I've got wings. And well, rice. you I don't got... have creamy mash. It's not the same, it's nothing similar. Niall's got hot and extra hot over there. I'm a bit of spice, me. Oh my god, look at these Christmas decorations. <laughs> look, there's jam on toast. Put it on the tree. Oh, it's squishy. Oof, it's squishy jam on toast. Look at this one. Oh, it's a tree. <laughs> it's avocado. Yeah, it's for a tree. I might get it for my mum. It's a joke. <laughs> Look at that! That's so cool! How weird, we're in Urban Outfitters by the way. We've now moved shops. How, oh look, Niall, they got Nutella. <laughs> look, they got the look, they got peanut butter and Nutella. Okay, so Urban Outfitters has some serious, serious Christmas day games. Look at this, I'm gonna get this one. Name the emoji, but it's not like just one emoji. Let me show you. Look at the back, look at this. So you got a Lion and King for liking. I'm gonna get this one. So, the shopping trip is finishing, and I'm feeling like a scrambled egg. Yeah. So, <laughs> so, so scrambled. All the makeup's gone off my face. You know you've been shopping when you lost all your makeup with sweat. It's very hot. That's that lipstick that you've got. I know, and I also tried on a lipstick about half an hour ago, gone. Absolutely gone. But yes, anyway, we're headed back to the car now. I've just picked up myself a smoothie from Boost. Absolutely love Boost. And I've just tried out a new flavour that I've never had before. It's called Mango Magic. And it is glorious. Niall wants to go back and get one, but I won't let him because it takes too long. Um, it's like banana, mango, yoghurt, honey. It's glorious. And I would 100% recommend. Anyway, I will probably see you at home and I'll do a little haul of all the things that I picked up, as long as it's not too dark. Maybe we will, we'll do it, because tomorrow morning I'm actually going to do my hair, maybe cutting it, definitely dyeing it. It's gonna be exciting, so I think we'll do the haul tonight. Maybe I'll add on the haircut, not sure, we'll see. Good evening everybody. I'm now back from shopping. Still looking like a scrambled egg. <laughs> I really need to get cozy and get my PJs. But before I do that, I just want to quickly give you a little bit of a haul of what we picked up today. I'm hoping very much so that the people that I tell not to watch this video because I've got a present for them won't. Otherwise I've ruined Christmas. <laughs> but anyway, let's just start. So um, what should we start with? So first of all, we have the jacket that you saw, so I'm not gonna get that out, that's the one for my mum. And then, there's a few bits that I picked up for myself, actually, let's show you them. So I, in the end in Zara, I did pick up the cable knit jumper because I have been wanting one like this, that's like a boyfriend kind of fit for a while. I, I feel like some baggy jumpers don't sit well. This one sat well, so I just wanted to grab her. And it's just really big and wonderful and warm. And Christmas tree color, almost. I mean, it's a dull Christmas tree, but it's it's close. <laughs> and I also picked up in Zara the kind of paler, paler colour jeans. Love them though. I would highly recommend. I've never really, I've never bought Zara jeans to be honest, because I just, I just find it hard to find jeans that fit nicely, that are like tight. And I'd always get go for the Joni Topshop jeans, as I was saying, but. 
I'm not really into the way they look anymore. I feel like they're almost too high-waisted. And I like having this sort of jean look at the top. I'll try my best to link those exact ones down below if you do want to have a grab, because I would highly recommend. Also, I did pick up a new lipstick, which I'm very excited about. I went into MAC and tried a few out and about. I picked up the Honey Love Matte Lipstick and also the Strip Down Lip Liner. And the Strip Down Lip Liner is kind of what makes it a vibe, because it's quite brown and then you get the nude in the mid oh it just makes a nice color i just i i said i think i said a while ago i want to find like a really nice nude because i always wear gloss i will still obviously wear my gloss because i love my gloss and it's just really easy but sometimes it'd be nice if i'm wearing like an evening outfit you know bit of a nude also also i did pick up this earring from claire's <laughs> when it's claire's i never go to claire's anymore claire's reminds me of being about two i was looking for like hair clips and just little bits and bobs sometimes claire's is good for and they had lots of i've been struggling to find to be honest good earrings for what is this called conch helix 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 i think it's a helix i just say top ear but basically i wanted like a nice one for my top ear that has the kind of circular back, you see? And this one's well and truly ready to be to be swapped. However, I can't get it out myself, so I'm gonna have to go to a piercer to ask. But I'm gonna swap it for this one. So it's kind of like, it's kind of a line of diamond, which is rather fancy. I mean, it's not diamond, it was £2.50, but I just think it'll look pretty and it, I'm hoping it'll sit nicely and go sort of round my ear, hoping. And then we've got a few bits from Urban Outfitters. So we picked up this game for Christmas take home to my mum and I did get my mum the, the avocado on toast Christmas decoration I just thought it was funny so I'm not going to give that to her on Christmas day I'm going to give it on Christmas Eve when we get there just as a, a joke present welcome I'm I'm back for Christmas here's an avocado on toast it's very weird though it's very spongy I wasn't expecting that I just thought it was quite funny I mean I don't know if she'll keep it on a tree it's a bit ugly but also I did pick up the name the emoji card game for Christmas as well I thought it'd be quite fun and I think, let's actually, let's have a look. I think what it does is it puts like a, a few emojis on a card and you've got to spell it out basically. Oh, I see. I mean, it's, it's not the most difficult game in the world, but I think after a few drinks, it could be quite funny. So for instance, this is Facebook. <laughs> and then you've got Guns and Roses. I mean, that's pretty obvious. And then we've got, oh, this is interesting. Oh, okay, so they don't always spell it out. So that's James Bond. So it's given symbols of the film. Like, would you know what this is? Yeah, Great British Bake Off. That's clever. Anyway, I'm going to stop looking at them or I'm giving it all away to myself. But yes, got that one. Thought it'd be fun on Christmas Day with some Prosecco and bagels. And also we picked up some bits for Niall's family. So, ooh, we did pick up the pink faux fur coats for his sisters. We got matching ones <laughs> from H&M. And we also picked up these lovely earrings for Niall's mum. They're very pretty. They're from Pandora. This is them. Look how sparkly they are. Look at that sparkle. Love it. I have to tell her not to watch this now. <laughs> yeah, we didn't actually end up finding all the presents that we were hoping to find. But I think I know kind of what I'm going to get now. So I'll do some online shopping for the rest of people. But... Anyway, that's my little haul. I think what I'm going to do now is wait for my food to cook and I'm going to catch up on Riverdale. I'm loving Riverdale. Let me know if you're watching. So I think I'm going to snuggle up with Bluebell and Pop and pop my candles on, get my PJs on, Christmas PJs, and get cosy. So I think I'm going to leave it here. I really hope you enjoyed this come shopping with me video. I really hope that you're enjoying Vlogmas. I really am enjoying Vlogmas. I'm just getting FOMO over the fact I'm not doing it every day. <laughs> but... It's not the end of the world. Next year we'll do it and hopefully we'll, who knows what life will be like next year. Maybe we'll be, I don't know, on the beach. <laughs> I don't know what I was going to say then. We are hoping we will be, in all seriousness, our new house, which will be, you know, a fun vlogmas. First, we'll be, we'll be hosting Christmas. So it'll be a very, very exciting Christmas if it all goes to plan, may not. But I will probably be doing everyday vlogmas next year and just manage it all better and get planning ahead. It's been a little bit of a busy month. There's lots of new plans and big decisions and things going on business-wise. So I think it would have been a little bit too hectic for my brain. So this year, but next year, I'm gonna make sure 
I'm ready for a vlogmas every day. <laughs> and I am gonna start singing more in them too because I know lots of people have commented and said, can I do more singing? Because I did last year. Anyway, thank you so, so much for watching. Please do let me know if you enjoyed. I really, really do hope you're enjoying my version of vlogmas. And I promise I have got lots more fun videos to come. So please come back and carry on watching my vlogmas because it's gonna be a good vlogmas. And I hope you're having a lovely day. Happy. Wait, what day is it going to be on this video? It's all a bit strange now because now the upload days, days that I'm used, used to are changing. So I think this video will be up on Saturday. Yes, we've never uploaded on a Saturday. That's interesting. Happy Saturday if you're watching on Saturday. Happy Sunday if you're watching on Sunday. Christmas.